you guys have played the big games. When you got down by eight, was there any panic or or was there a thought over there on the sideline, we're going to do this? No, I, don't, I wouldn't panic. Um, you know, I thought we could go down the field and really move on them. In the second half, they did start bringing a little bit more pressure off the edges, off both edges, uh, trying to stop the run. So that's when we started using the pass a little bit more and see it work. We, you know, we work those things in practice. We have those two minutes. Being what you guys have gone through success-wise the last few years, is it just a whole different level of calmness and confidence on the sidelines now in a football game like that as opposed to when you were a freshman? Uh, yeah, because we all have confidence in each other. I mean, I can look at Deshaun, I can look at Tay, Mike, and know that they're going to be all right and you know, they're not going to take a play off. So I should be the same. So, you know, it's just that confidence that we build not only in the game, but in practice. Right. Well, you go out there on that, that last drive, Got 85 yards to go win the game, or at that point, you know what was the what was Deshaun's mood, and, and how did you guys kind of play off of that the way he was responding? Um, really, our whole mood was hey, we got to win the game. You know, um, everybody had to make plays, players had to make plays. So you know, Deshaun to make the throw, and the guy catch it. That was my whole mindset going into it. That was the first time Deshaun actually had to go lead a game-winning drive since he's been here. You know, I mean, I, need, I knew you guys knew he could do it, but I mean, for him to go out there and, and do it the way he did and the calmness that he showed, that's just who he is and, I guess, and how he's always acts. Yeah, yeah. Like I said, it all comes with hard work and grind and practice. You know, we're the one for the things that we do in practice. I don't think that, you know, we do what we want to do. We're just prepared. You know, we see how he prepares do you learn something about yourselves though when because there's you guys have had hairy moments last year Notre Dame Georgia Tech two weeks ago where the game gets closer but you still don't have to go out and score because you're down I mean that's that's been rare here right. and um, you know the focus is to try to do our best to get out of the field because we know we can score but also try to keep the defense off the field because we know how hard they work you know, our defense did a great job against Louisville. You know, Lamar, how good of a quarterback he is, and the crazy stuff he was doing. I'm just glad we got to, uh, you know, go out there and really dominate that last couple minutes. The, the game unfolded as it, as it did against Louisville, but going forward, is time of possession trying to milk more? Like, I mean, defense was out there for 99 plays the other night. Yeah, um, yeah we just got to do our part and make sure we have the ball and make really consistent drives. Coaches hammered home ball security. Even though no, I don't think any fumbles by the running backs, but no. ball security going to be a big focus this week for the whole team. Yeah, every week. You know, that's Coach Ellis, That's his biggest focus with us, and it's really becoming a focus on everybody. Not only offense, but even on defense. If they get a pick, they got to do. You know, so ball security is a plus.